what the word commute means. Commute. Commute. I asked if your parents commute to work, or how far they commute to work. Grace. It is not. Subtract. Kelsey? No, that would be communicate. Commute. Gary? Distance? Yeah, distance or to move. Okay, and the commutative property, commutative property says that with addition, for instance, 6 plus 7, you would get the same answer if you move those numbers around. In other words, 6 plus 7 is the same thing as 7 plus 6. You still get 13 for both of those. Okay, to which you're going to say, duh. But what you must understand, children, is because you've been doing this, you don't have to realize that that property does not work for all things. For example, subtraction. If I take uh, 7 minus 2, is that the same as 2 minus 7? 7 minus 2 is 5. If you have $2 and subtract 7 from it, you actually end up in the negative number of things. Okay, so 2 minus 5, 7, two, 7 minus 2 is 5, but 2 minus 7 is actually negative 5. So the commutative property doesn't work with everything. It works with addition, because you can change the order, and it also works with multiplication. And that's the reason why 8 times 2 is the same thing as 2 times 8. The commutative property says that with addition and subtract or addition and multiplication, you can change the order. And that's a good thing. Why? Because, well, you've been doing this for a while. If you have 8 plus 7 plus 2 plus 3, okay, when you were adding those numbers together, what have you been taught to do? Probably even since second grade or even third grade, Calvin? Well, write it up and down, but to make it easier for you, you've always been told to do what, Jacob? Find the, like, make the numbers and make them 10. Yeah, find the groups of 10. So when you write this up and down, it's easier for you if you put the 2 next to the 8, because that gives you 10, and the 7 next to the 3, because that gives you 10. So you end up with 10 plus 10 is 20. So life becomes much easier if you use the commutative property to your benefit. Okay, perfect. Uh, then we have another property, blank piece of paper. 